Digital transformation initiatives have made business data more accessible, while the cybersecurity threat landscape has continued to rapidly evolve. For digital transformation to provide a positive ROI, processes, data, and all communications must be secured. That's why Frost & Sullivan has outlined four cybersecurity trends that C-suite executives and board of directors should know about in 2019. Quantum-resistant cryptography, securing IoT, securing enterprise communications, and the global state of online digital trust. Looking toward quantum-resistant cryptography, it's important to understand that quantum computing won't be available commercially for several years, but when it does reach the market, today's encryption won't be able to secure our business data, which is why research engineers are working today to develop quantum-resistant encryption, to protect enterprise before quantum computers are used by governments and subsequently by enterprise. Looking at securing IoT, it's important to know that in 2019, there will be an estimated 26.2 billion connected IoT devices. The challenge in securing that many devices isn't just related to the sheer number. It's also because devices ship with firmware from different operating systems and with different patching cycles. Many are connected into manufacturing processes, smart cities, and smart homes, which makes the attack surface extremely broad. Compounding the challenge is that many devices ship with security by design instead of security by default that forces end users to securely set up IoT devices. When we look towards securing enterprise communications, we see that since 2012, examples of hackers eavesdropping on law enforcement conference calls, nation states hacking into the mobile phones of allies, and email communications from politicians hacked and distributed to newspapers around the world. Utilizing encryption technologies to secure enterprise communications from email to instant messaging to voice communications is a necessity for firms that want to maintain a competitive edge. One of the key things that we're talking about also when we talk about securing enterprise communications is securing conference calls. If someone like myself were to go into a secured conference call, I would have myself authenticated by the platform and so everyone would be certain that it is me getting into the conference call. Encryption technologies can be used to secure the enterprise in many ways executives haven't considered. And as an added benefit, they can actually reduce communication costs. Frost and Sullivan Research examine the issue and provides key insights for enterprise and end users prior to purchasing the solution. When we look toward the global state of digital trust, many enterprises don't know that 86% of worldwide consumers state that data protection is a priority when they choose the online services they want to do business with. Although four out of five enterprises believe that consumers have more digital trust in companies than they had two years ago, the fact is that only two out of every five consumers said that they're more trusting today when doing business online than they were two years ago. Enterprises believe that they are doing things to properly protect uh, consumer data, but consumers are seeing more and more data breaches um, with each passing month. One cannot measure digital trust based on internal initiatives at your organization. It is also about measuring the, the market out there that you're serving. Our research has shown a direct link between eroding digital trust brand equity, and enterprise revenue. Frost & Sullivan's global cybersecurity research team provides thought-leading insights on these issues and is expanding its cybersecurity coverage in 2019 around the world to ensure executives have the market insight that they need to make informed decisions throughout the year.